tomorrow, I, I know you're going to tell us you just made shots, but uh, Dwayne was suggesting there were subtle changes that got you more space in that first quarter. Is that true? Yeah, we put in a couple of new sets and you know, and shoot around, and you know, we came out with it. And you know, but I came out aggressive, you know, looking for my shot, understanding, picking, choosing, you know, where I was going to shoot from, and you know, they went down tonight. And Kyle, you guys were more aggressive defensively, I think, consistently in this game than you were in the first two. Let's talk about feeding off that energy or that that hard play. Well, I think you know the the way they came out, you know, kind of made us even up our our intensity. Also, you know, they came out super high intensity, um, super forceful. So we had to match that intensity. Uh, we knew they were going to come out like that, so we just had to match the intensity and go back, you know, go back and forth with them. I guess this is a question for both of you. The way Damari played tonight, is that what you expected out of a healthy Damari Carroll at this time in the playoffs? Yeah, that's big. You know, that's definitely big. <clears throat> and, you know, he playing great defense at the same time. You know, um, that's what we expected when he, you know, came to this team. And it sucks that he had to miss so many games. But, you know, that's the Damari we know. Yeah, I agree. I didn't even know he had 17 points. It's pretty uh, – this is a bonus of the things he's doing. Kyle, how much of a relief was it for you to – when DeMar comes down and hits that end one to start the game and knocks in a couple more buckets, did it kind of, the bench went crazy. What was it like uh, on the floor with him? Well, just, you know, seeing the ball go through the hoop for him is always a positive. And, you know, I'm not really – I'm not too concerned about him shooting shots and missing shots or making shots. I'm just – it was just a good sign for us as a team, you know, to, to – Take that first punch, you know. Hit a, they hit a three, and we come back and get an one. So it's just a relief for us to, okay, we good. You know, we can we match the intensity, we match the the, the progression of the game. You guys had had leads in games one and two, but couldn't necessarily put them away. And yet here you had leads and held on to it and increased those. What was the difference tonight versus the last couple of games? You know, we got to understand, you know, no matter if we get a lead, you know, they're going to ramp it up. You know, they definitely going to try to get back in the game, and we got to sustain that best way we can. And the only way to do that is stay, you know, consistent on the defensive end and, you know, buckle down when they try to make a run. We guys, Indiana went to the free throw line more than twice the amount of time that you guys did. You guys were whistled for nine more fouls, but it seemed like, there, I don't know if it was legit or not, a concerted effort to put your head down and to not talk or not be as frustrated tonight, whereas they seemed to be kind of getting riled up, teed up two, three times. You guys were walking away quite a bit tonight. Was that part of the game plan to not let the officials or anything else get to you? Um, no, it's just, you know, that's how we operate. You know, you know, sometimes we've had a few games where we've, you know, gotten our, you know, back and forth, but at the end of the day, we still got to go play. You know, we, we know that we know the situation we're in. We knew the environment that we were going to be in. So we just had to go out there, do our jobs, you know, and, and, and do our game plan. And tonight, we we got the win by doing that. Demar, uh, you had your best game. Kyle knocks down four threes. Demar is locking up Paul George. Does this feel like the best game of the series? Does this feel like the team you guys can be? <coughs> so far, no. We're much better than what we played tonight, honestly. Um, we just got to keep building every single game, keep building, keep continuing to get better on both ends. And you know, once we get that rhythm, you know, it's going to be, it's definitely going to be tough, you know, for to to beat us. And we understand that. And that's why, you know, we take it so serious when we in shoot around, if we in practice, if we watching film, because there's always ways we can figure out how to get better. 